Um, we're getting down to the end of our time, but I wanted to see if you could, I can't remember if you talked about this in your um, presentation, if you could talk a little bit about how long the entire procedure takes and if there's anything that people should do to prepare for it, to get ready to come in. Is there anything that helps yeah. them you know, on the front end? Sure. So uh, Gamma and I, if usually there's a couple consultations that happen ahead of time, usually a tour of the facility pre-COVID, um, we're even getting, but basically the way that we run at Valley Hospital is patients come into their own nice little room with a TV and a radio around six in the morning. There's really no need to stop medications or pack a bag, right? So you have a family member come with you, check in, you sit down in a nice room and uh, we give you some medicine, a pill usually just to calm you down and we put some cream on your scalp to start numbing it. Then by 6.30 in the morning, I'm usually placing that head frame takes about 10 minutes, 15 minutes to put that frame on. Then patients are sent in within our building to an MRI scanner across the hall. We get the necessary pictures in the frame. And then by 8.30, the pictures are up on our planning station and we're planning our target dose. And say usually by nine, you're moving into the actual gamma knife machine. You lay on a nice couch. The head frame holds your head in plate. We do a few timeouts. We all leave the room, we can talk to you, see you, you can speak to us, and then the machine does its thing. We hit a button, the machine moves your head into the right position, prescribes the right doses to your tumor, and down to the 10th of a minute, we know exactly how long the gamma knife's gonna give you the radiation. It's usually less than an hour. Okay. So then maybe by 10 o'clock, you're off the machine, you go back into your own private room, the head frame's removed, maybe a couple little band-aids here, uh, and then a family member usually takes you home within 45 minutes. So if you're the first patient of the day, um, that's usually how it runs. So on average in our center, you're leaving by 1030 or 1130 and you're, you're going home. A um, couple restrictions, which is basically don't go crazy that first day. You don't drive yourself home because we gave you some Ativan or some Valium, but there's no IVs. You know, there's really not a lot of downtime. The next day you can go do whatever you want to do. Um, the only thing I tell people is not to schedule gamma knife right before wedding photos or something else. Cause sometimes your forehead gets a little puffy and you don't want to, you know, you don't want to plan pictures right after that. But other than that, people can go back to work. There's no lifting restrictions. There's no driving restrictions. Great. Well, thank you so much for your time today. Thank you for taking the time to answer all these thank questions. You. And um, we really, really appreciate it. I want to tell everyone that's watching, I want to thank you for taking the time to join us today and um, let you know that um, our website is www.anausa.org. You can check that out. We're having, because of COVID, most of our support group meetings have moved to a virtual format. So we have um, support group meetings happening and they are happening all over the country. However, location isn't quite as important right now. So anybody is welcome to attend. You do have to register, but you're welcome to attend any of those. So some of them are um, just caring and sharing what we typically do and then other words have presentations. So um, check out our website and look for those. And then also follow us there and on our social media for more presentations like this. We are working to set up more um, Facebook lives and webinars for the fall. So we'll be having those coming up. And again, I want to thank you all for attending and, and Dr. D'Ambrosio, thank you so much for yeah, taking Yeah, no, time. thank you. Be safe, everybody. It. Have a great afternoon. Okay, thank you.